You feel weird? He said no. I feel weird. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Ask me what's up. Boxes in here are being taken out right now. Gotta get our bookshelf taken care of, bicycle, desk, office chair, oh, yeah. laundry machine is gone. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Christ. It's a rainy day today. Not too bad, it could be a lot worse. But. Goodbye, Yokohama. From the other side. On a sunny day, you can see all the way out towards Minato Mirai which is really nice. So the movers have been in and out all day since like 8 a.m. And it is now noon. <laughs> so. Boxes everywhere. So many boxes. Today is the day. All of our stuff leaves the apartment. Panic. We are getting a car and we are going to be driving down to Kyoto. So this is a final goodbye to Chukagai, Yokohama Chinatown. So, a little sad. I'm going to miss the food, but we've got a day of driving ahead of us and I can't legally drive in Japan, so I have to act as support <laughs> for the entire day. We got a playlist, we will get food, he has his energy drink, energy drink, so let's go. Changes when in love, yeah I surround my soul with the positivity That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see, yeah These days I don't worry about much I think we should have some more fun I still dream about the days when we were young I'll take a hit and still finish in one, yeah just keep saying it just feels like we're leaving for a trip it's the day before a trip <laughs> and yeah I think it's a very good way to put it um, also I'm at his family's house and the windows are open and I don't want the neighbors or anybody else to hear me talking to myself and think I'm crazy um, so I'm talking quietly but got some last minute laundry hanging up Got our carry-on, backpack, suitcase, and I'm just cleaning up the little bits and pieces, packing up the switch, um, computers, charging everything. I have no idea what to expect, so I don't know how I feel, and I'm excited. 
I know that I'm nervous. <laughs> I think anybody would be. Um, but I mean, the whole picking up and moving isn't uh, new to me. This is the third time, technically. First time as an exchange student, second time as an employee. And now we're moving to Germany. And, um, you know, there's going to be new culture shocks to deal with, new foods, new people, new language. And I think the number one thing that has me nervous is the not being able to communicate for myself in German, <laughs> which I should have studied a lot more before I did. And I was studying and then I got overwhelmed and it just, I stopped. And so Duolingo keeps sending me messages and they're really annoyed at me. <laughs> But, yeah, a lot of new things to learn, a lot of new things to experience. I'm excited for castles and beer, though. I'm really looking forward to that. And I, I've got a few friends in Europe, so I'm excited being able to see them. And I already told him, honeymoon is going to be our first trip um, outside of Germany. And it's going to be Italy, and he cannot disagree on that. It will be Italy. <laughs> Which means I also need to learn some Italian. <sighs> Keep slamming doors. I'm in a house full of boys. Doors are slamming everywhere. So, yeah, it's Everything leading up to this has been fine, though. The uh, His company uh, took care of everything, all of the moving of the things for our house. We're going to be staying in employee, employee housing for a little bit. Um, so that's really helpful for us. Oh, my God. So things will be taken care of. Okay. So right now on the train, head to the airport. And there's Hello Kitty. So final train ride in Japan. Very Japan. Is, mine's like a spicy chili fried chicken. We've got, uh, what's that again? Got two beers. And pizza soda. So we just got to the airport. We're just organizing our bags a little bit. And then we're gonna check in. Trying to get as much of the contact solution as we can in case they make us throw it out, even though it's in the checked in luggage. You feel weird? He said no. I feel weird. But let's see. We have a stop in Dubai. And then from Dubai, we have a three hour layover, which is kind of short. Hopefully, nothing goes wrong. And I'll go knock on some wood later. <laughs> and after Dubai, Germany. <laughs> but I did buy the BBC Pride and Prejudice with Colin Firth. So I will be watching that. I'm very much looking forward to it. <laughs> but lots of emotions. Not really processing them at the moment, but it is what it is. The airplane's right over there. We've made it through security, we made it through check-in. Waiting at the gate, we got another hour and a half or so. And I'm on our way. So that's it, yeah. But I got my last little fix of cute pens. I'm excited for these and they're erasable. So if you know, you know. But this is it. Five years. It's been five years. Now we're leaving. Very bittersweet.